Well, thank you, uh, Tanner Watson, a.k.a. A Tangled Web, uh, for performing on Ad uh, Advocate Sessions today. Thanks thank so you. much for having me. Thank you for having me. Uh, can you t uh, uh, first off uh, tell us uh, how you got started uh, with your solo project? Uh, it started uh, after I cleaned up uh, from an addiction, and uh, I was like, one of the big things I lost was music, so that was like huge for me. I got a, uh, a silver tone acoustic guitar from the Salvation Army, like the 50s, super cool, totally just a horrible guitar. But it, uh, I, I started writing songs and I was like, yeah, I wanna do a full band of this and you know, got together and it just sorta of went from there. It was really, um, not to sound cliche, but like therapeutic, you know, to get back into music because that was a huge thing that I had lost, you know? So it just started from there, you know, just a couple guys. But. And uh, how long were you playing music beforehand? Uh, I've been playing since I was like, probably 16-ish years. Um, but yeah, as, as a Tangled Web, it's been about three and a half, four years. But yeah. Okay. Um, so um, obviously a lot of your songs are about uh, your own personal yeah. experience with addiction and yeah overcoming that addiction yeah uh do, do you think uh that changed you as an artist uh um probably as a as a person too but um yeah how did it change you as an artist um i mean i i i kind of knew like that i was definitely i mean obviously the denial when you're an addict when you're in the throes of addiction but uh like I said, I wrote that song 4320 when I was really in the thick of it because, like, I knew, like, I might be dead before I ever record this song. So, like, I kind of wrote a song as, like, uh, maybe I can record it and that can be, like, my last goodbye if this thing really takes over and just ends me, you know? Um, but it definitely, definitely shaped who I am. It, you know, it taught me to be a lot more humble and uh, just appreciate certain things. Like I said, like, music was one thing that just got lost within my addiction I just didn't you know didn't care anymore and it just got thrown to the side so that was a huge thing uh, for me was getting that back but it absolutely changed who I am both as a person and as an artist because you know you get a whole nother perspective when you come out of this darkness and you get to look back at the darkness you know from this different place and it's just it it's hugely influenced. My whole uh, A Tangled Web's Love Violent EP was kind of like my own uh, therapeutic um, process where I dealt with like different aspects of all the things that I had lost through my addiction I was trying to regain. And uh, it was just, you know, I wrote, I wrote our Love Violent EP, wrote and recorded it in an apartment in Springfield you know, uh, right near Mercy's emergency room exit, just like a small little one, you know, my one bedroom apartment. So it was hugely therapeutic and it definitely, there was a lot of influence from all the things that I've been through. Yeah. You know, does that personal, uh, experience, you still draw upon that, uh, for songwriting or do you, uh, are there other topics that you tend to write about now? Yeah. I mean, it's, it's kind of like, uh, now I'm looking at it as like, okay, I'm a, I'm a normal, quote unquote, normal person again, you know, like, and so it's weird, like adjusting and dealing with that, like, okay, I dealt with all these problems before, but now I have to deal with them without this outlet that I had, you know, without this drug or this addiction that I would just escape from it all. So, you know, music obviously took its place and it's kind of, kind of pushed me like I'm try I try not to write about things that are like disingenuous to me like I always try to make it from the heart so I still draw from it but I, I try not to do so much to where it's like okay it's a little a little overplayed there bud let's tone it back you know <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think it's great that you have somewhat of a sense of humor about the yeah I mean because for a lot of people that's a uh, uh, great darkness yeah I mean you know like uh uh, I'm a huge comic book fan, so the the comedian, you know, in The Watchmen was always like, you know, just he, his whole thing was find the humor in it, you know, and so I just, I've kind of taken that, not to so much of a nihilist point of view like he had, but, you know, it's like, even in the darkest times, like, there's always something you can be happy about, you know, you dig deep. So are you working on any uh, new recordings, or? Um, a Tangled Web has kind of reached like a hibernation stage but we have a uh 
an EP called uh, Revenge, Regret, and Rebuild. And it's a, a three-song concept EP, very short, just basically about, like, the aftermath of uh, a relationship falling out. Uh, we're recording that with uh, Fermata Face Studios in Springfield, and I think that might be tentatively the last release we do for a while, but it was cool to, like, you know, write an album with a concept, like, you know, revenge right after the relationship ends, regret you know, after you've done these terrible things to get back a person, then rebuild, like, moving on. Like, it's, again, like, sort of, you know, my wife and I are mar happily married and such, but it was, like, it was it was cool to sort of draw on old experiences to try to, again, a, music is just one big therapy f session for me, you know. So. Do, you, do you have any shows uh, coming up, uh, either uh, uh, Tangle, uh, Tangled Web or uh, The Screaming Hearts? Yeah, uh, The Screaming Hearts, we got a show in Northampton on December 26th, and then uh, Luthier's co-op in January. Um, that's kind of where my main focus is switched to. It's, it's kind of nice, like, going from being the uh, lead singer-songwriter to just being, like, the guitar player-songwriter and just sort of focusing strictly on music, you know. Um, but yeah, we got some stuff coming up, uh, The Screaming Hearts. You can check us out on Facebook, Instagram, all those great social media sites. All right. Well, thank you so much, uh, uh, Tanner, for cool. performing on Advocate Sessions today. Thank you for having me, man.